Hello everyone, thank you for joining me. I'm Kerry. Today I'll be showing you how to crochet this butterfly. I'll be using four ply crochet cotton and I've got seven colours. I've got black for the body and red, yellow, orange, aqua, green and blue for the wings. I've got a 1.25mm crochet hook, my scissors, black sewing thread and sewing needle to stitch on the upper body and I've got a darning needle to weave in my ends. Now underneath my upper body I've got a small section of black that I crochet the wings onto. So I'll start with the body part and I start with 15 chain. I miss the first chain and I work one single crochet into each stitch to the end. So I'll work that and I'll meet you at the end of the row. Once I get to the end of the row I work one chain and then I work one single crochet into the back of each chain. So just into that back loop in there. So I'll finish this row and I'll be back. Now I've finished the row so I fasten off and that's just the small body part done. Now I'm going to start on this section of the wing here. So I join my cotton to the very end stitch and work 25 chain. I work one treble in the fifth chain from the hook. And then work two double treble into each of the next two stitches. Then work a join treble over the following two stitches. One treble into each of the next three stitches. A join treble over the following two stitches. One double crochet into each of the next three stitches.
one half double crochet into each of the following five stitches and one single crochet into each stitch to the end. And join with a slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. Now I'll just weave in my ends because I'll find it easier they'll just get in the way if I don't fasten them off. For the next segment I join my cotton five stitches down from the end in this stitch here and I start with four chain and work three treble into the same stitch as the chain. Now I work one treble into each of the next four stitches A join treble over the following two stitches one double crochet into each of the following three stitches One half double crochet into each of the next three stitches. And one single crochet into each of the last four stitches. And then slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. So I'll weave in that end and I'll be back and we'll do the next section. For our third segment we join our cotton five stitches from the end of the second segment. So in here And we start with four chain and work three treble into the same place as the chain. and then work one treble into each of the next three stitches.
a join treble over the following two stitches. One double crochet into each of the next three stitches. One half double crochet into each of the following three stitches. One single crochet into the next stitch and two single crochet into the last stitch. And slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. So I'll weave in the this end and I'll be back to do the next segment. For the next segment we join four stitches on from the end of the wing. And we start with four chain. And we work three treble into the same place as our chain. And then one treble into each of the next four stitches. A joined treble over the following two stitches. One double crochet into each of the next three stitches. A half double crochet into the following two stitches. and two single crochet into the last stitch. Slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. The next segment we join our cotton four stitches from the end of the fourth segment. So in here and start with four chain and work three treble into the same place as the chain.
one treble into each of the next two stitches. A join treble over the following two stitches. One double crochet into each of the next three stitches. A half double crochet into each of the following three stitches. And a single crochet into the last stitch. And then slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. For the next segment we start five stitches in from the end of our last segment and start with four chain and work three treble into the same place as our chain. And then work one double crochet into each of the next five stitches. One half double crochet into each of the following two stitches. And two single crochet into the last stitch. Slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. For the next segment, this one here, I'm using my red again and I join four stitches from the end and work four chain and three treble into the same place as the chain. One treble into each of the next two stitches. One double crochet into each of the following two stitches. One half double crochet into each of the next two stitches.
and a single crochet into each of the last two stitches. And slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. For the next wing segment we start the second stitch from the end of the last segment and we start with 5 chain we work 3 treble into the 5th chain from the hook One treble into that same stitch where we started the chain and a treble into the next stitch. We work two treble into the following stitch. One double crochet into each of the next three stitches. A half double crochet into each of the following three stitches. A single crochet into the last stitch and slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. For the next row we start on the last stitch of our last segment. and start with 6 chain. We miss 4 chain and we work 2 treble into each of the following 2 chain. And then we work a treble into the same stitch where we joined for our chain. We work two treble into the following stitch. And one treble into each of the following two stitches. Two double crochet into the next stitch then one double crochet into each of the following three stitches one half double crochet into each of the next three stitches and one single crochet into each of the remaining stitches.
and then slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. For our next segment we join two stitches from the end of the previous segment and we start with six chain We miss four chain and work two treble into each of the last two chain. Now work one treble into the stitch where we join for our chain and the next stitch. Two treble into the following stitch. and then one treble into each of the next four stitches. Now to double crochet into each of the following two stitches. One double crochet into each of the next four stitches. One half double crochet into the following four stitches. and then one single crochet into each stitch to the end and join with a slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. For the next row we join three stitches from the end of our previous section. And work six chain. We miss four chain and work two treble into each of the next two chain.
one treble into the stitch where we joined our chain and the following two stitches. Two treble into the following stitch. One treble into each of the next four stitches. Two double crochet into the next stitch. One double crochet into each of the next five stitches. Two half double crochet into the following stitch. One half double crochet into each of the next four stitches. And one single crochet into each of the last six stitches. And slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. For the last part of the wing we start four stitches back from the end of our previous row and we work eight chain. We miss the first four chain and work one treble into each of the remaining four chain. And then we work a join treble into the stitch where we started our chain and the next stitch. And another join treble over the following two stitches. Then one treble into each of the next three stitches. Two treble into the following stitch.
one treble into each of the next four stitches. Two double crochet in the following stitch. One double crochet into each of the next four stitches. Two double crochet into the following stitch. One half double crochet into each of the next three stitches. And a single crochet into each stitch to the end. And slip stitch into the next stitch on the body and fasten off. And that's the first side done. Now for the second side, using my blue, I work 21 chain. Now I join to the body across from the bottom side just in there slip stitch in and then I slip stitch into the next stitch down And I work one single crochet into each of the next three chain. One half double crochet into each of the following five stitches. One double crochet into each of the next three stitches. A join treble over the following two stitches.
one treble into each of the next three stitches A join treble over the following two stitches. Two double treble into each of the next two stitches A treble into the last stitch and then four chain and slip stitch into the same place as your last treble and fasten off. For the second section, we join one stitch up on the body and work one single crochet into each of the first four stitches. A half double crochet into each of the following three stitches. One double crochet into each of the next three stitches. A join treble over the following two stitches. One treble into each of the next four stitches. and then three treble into the next stitch. Then work four chain and slip stitch into the same place as our last treble 
and fasten off. For our next segment, we join one stitch down on the body We work two single crochet into our first stitch and one single crochet into the next stitch. Then one half double crochet into each of the next three stitches. One double crochet into each of the following three stitches. The join treble over the next two stitches. One treble into each of the following three stitches. Three treble into the next stitch. Four chain and slip stitch into the same place as our last trebles. And fasten off. The next part we join one stitch down on the body and work two single crochet into the first stitch one half double crochet into each of the next two stitches One double crochet into each of the following three stitches. One join treble over the following two stitches. One treble into each of the next four stitches.
three treble into the next stitch. Four chain. And slip stitch into the same place as our trebles. And fasten off. With the next section, we join in the next stitch on our body and work one single crochet in the first stitch and then one half double crochet into each of the next three stitches One double crochet into each of the following three stitches. A joined treble over the next two stitches. One treble into each of the next two stitches. And three treble into the following stitch. Then work four chain and slip stitch into the same stitch as the trebles and fasten off. For our next section we join in the next stitch on the body. We work two single crochet into the first stitch one half double crochet into each of the next two stitches One double crochet into each of the next five stitches. Three treble into the following stitch. Four chain and slip stitch into the same place as our last trebles. 
and fasten off. For our next segment, using the red again, I join in the stitch, next stitch on the body. And I work one single crochet into each of the first two stitches. One half double crochet into each of the following two stitches. One double crochet into each of the next two stitches. One treble into each of the following two stitches. And three treble into the next stitch. And then work four chain and slip stitch into the same place as the last trebles and fasten off. For the next section we join one stitch up on the body and work one single crochet in the first stitch and then one half double crochet into each of the next three stitches. Then one double crochet into each of the following three stitches. Two treble in the following stitch. One treble into each of the next two stitches. And four treble into the next stitch. Then work four chain and slip stitch into the same stitch as our last trebles and fasten off. For my next segment I'm going to join just in the last stitch of the previous row and I'm going to work two chain and fasten off. This is using the K 
color that I'll be using for my next segment. And then I join into the next stitch on the body. And I work two single crochet into the first stitch. One single crochet into the next stitch. One half double crochet into each of the next three stitches. One double crochet into each of the following three stitches. Two double crochet into the next stitch. One treble into each of the next two stitches. Two treble into the following stitch. One treble into each of the next two stitches. And then two treble into each of the chain. Then work four chain and slip stitch into the same place as our last trebles and fasten off. Now with the colour we'll be using for our next section we join two stitches down from the end of the last section and work two chain and fasten off. And then join into the next stitch on our body. and work one single crochet into each of the first three stitches. One half double crochet into each of the following four stitches. One double crochet into each of the next four stitches.
to double crochet into the following stitch and then to double crochet into the next stitch as well. One treble into each of the next four stitches. To treble into the next stitch one treble into the next stitch and then one treble into the same stitch as where you joined for your chain. And then two treble into each of the two chain. Then four chain and then slip stitch into the same stitch as our last trebles and fasten off. For the next section we join our cotton three stitches from the end of our last section and work two chain and fasten off. Then we join into the next stitch on the body. and work one single crochet into each of the first six stitches. Then one half double crochet into each of the following four stitches. Two half double crochet into the next stitch. One double crochet into each of the following five stitches. Two double crochet into the next stitch. One treble into each of the next four stitches.
to treble into the next stitch. One treble into each of the next two stitches and also the stitch where you joined for the chain. And then two treble into each of the chain. Then four chain and slip stitch into the same place as the last treble. And fasten off. Now for our last section using our last colour, we join four stitches back from the end. And work four chain. And fasten off. And then join our colour to the next stitch on the body. And work one single crochet into each of the first eight stitches. One half double crochet into each of the next three stitches. Two double crochet into the next stitch. One double crochet into each of the following four stitches. Two double crochet into the next stitch. One treble into each of the following four stitches. Two treble into the next stitch.
one treble into each of the next three stitches. Two joined treble over the next four stitches. And then one treble into each stitch to the end. And then four chain. And slip stitch into the same place as our last treble. And fasten off. And that's the butterfly done. It will flatten out when I iron it. Now for the upper body, I make a magic loop and work three chain and one double crochet into my circle. I pull the circle tight, but I don't join. I work three chain and turn for row two, I work one double crochet into our first stitch and then one double crochet into the top of the chain. For row three, we start with three chain and turn and we work one double crochet into each of the two stitches. For row four, we start with three chain and turn. We work one double crochet into each of the two stitches and one double crochet into the top of the chain. For row 5 we start with 3 chain and turn and we work 1 double crochet into each of the 3 stitches. For row 6 we start with 3 chain and turn we work one double crochet into each of the three stitches and one double crochet into the top of the chain. For row seven we start with three chain and turn and we work one double crochet into each of our four stitches.
for raw white we start with four chains and we work a treble cluster over all our stitches. Now we work 12 chain We work a single crochet in the third chain from the hook and then work a slip stitch into each stitch to the end into each of our chain. And then we slip stitch into the head and work another 12 chain and we work a single crochet in the third chain from the hook and then work a slip stitch into each of our chain down to the head. Then we slip stitch into the head and fasten off. And there's our body done. I'll just weave in the ends and I'll give the wings a press and I'll be back and we'll put it together. Now there's the two pieces finished off and and ironed. For this one there's not much making up. I just have to attach the upper body across the top of the body like that. So I'll do that and I'll be back and show you the finished butterfly. And there's a finished butterfly along with some in different colours. If you like my video please like, subscribe and share. I'm also on Instagram, Pinterest, Facebook and Twitter the details are in the description below, along with the details of my website where my patterns are. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.